We introduce our innovative robot named Adam, short for Aerial and Terrestrial Mode Operating Monowing. Through careful frame design and positioning of the center of gravity, we've achieved three static equilibrium positions for Adam on the ground, two for takeoff in clockwise and counterclockwise directions for aerial mode, and one for terrestrial mode. In aerial mode, Adam utilizes the bottom-mounted motor for flight and directional control, while the other motor balances the torque produced. This torque balancing indirectly controls the robot's rotational speed during flight. We have the capability to control Adam's rotational speed, ranging from 48 to 60 radians per second in both clockwise and counterclockwise directions. Adam can follow a trajectory accurately while spinning in either direction. We obtained a root mean square error of 0.11 meters while following the trajectory and changing altitude simultaneously. Terrestrial locomotion in Adam involves three distinct stages, the start of rolling, continuous rolling, and stopping. Here, we can observe in slow motion how throttle is applied during each of these stages. Adam utilizes differential thrust of motors to turn while stationary. Here, we highlight Adam's ability to roll and turn on various surfaces. Adam can accurately track waypoints in terrestrial mode by obtaining position feedback from motion cameras. Here, we can see the robot tracking waypoints forming a square shape. The robot can also change direction, without stopping, by turning while rolling. In this maneuver, we provide a low magnitude impulse thrust to change direction when the robot is in the desired orientation, as shown here. Adam has the capability to perform control descents and descents on inclined surfaces with gradients of up to 15 degrees. We can perform both continuous and incremental rolls for ascending or descending. Here, we are demonstrating the control transition from aerial mode to terrestrial mode. During this process, both motors provide throttle until the robot has crossed the threshold angle for transition. Adam can achieve a predetermined and controlled transition to any of the aerial mode passive states on the ground. This process involves rolling the robot forward and then providing the necessary throttle for a seamless transition. Adam can perform bidirectional transitions on various surfaces, both indoors and outdoors. Here, we showcase Adam's outdoor performance for ascending a 5-degree inclined, pebble floor. Adam's versatility extends to real-life applications, such as surveillance and infrastructure mapping when equipped with a camera. In this hybrid outdoor demonstration, we can observe Adam as it smoothly transitions from terrestrial mode to aerial mode, takes off and flies in the aerial mode. Transitions back to terrestrial mode and moves across the uneven grass terrain using incremental rolls. Here, we are demonstrating Adam's ability to do close inspection of objects in an indoor environment. With its ability to control the roll angle, Adam achieves a wide vertical field of view exceeding 180 degrees with the camera. This allows Adam to be used for close inspection of objects both on the ground and at elevated heights. <laughs>